my goodness. Hi, welcome to the Laser Time stream, everybody. It is Christopher here. Um, got a hot heart. Got it. All right. And Christopher here. We're playing Gears of War. How's our sound, everybody? It's a little loud in my headphones, but uh, we'll see what people say. Uh, I, uh, this is the uh, Laser Time stream of Gears of War 4. I played a little bit of it. I did pick up the uh, early edition Friday. Um, so I played a bit of it. We're going to show you a little bit of the campaign. I've skipped the prologue. I'm jumping you straight into the raid mission. Um, the raid chapter, should I say? Speak your microphone, buddy. Can't, can't hear you. Um, how's our sound, everybody? Let us know. Uh, I think it says sounds fine. All right. There we go. CDG uh, comedy asking, where's the resonator? Uh, guys, the resonator has been replaced. The resonator was inside of us all along. Go, go! The resonator was the friend made along the way. Uh. So these, I, I forget where the story is at this point. Everyone who introduced yourself. I am Chris. No, no one uh, introduced himself. I said it, I said oh, okay. it already. So Sorry, I was pretty, pretty occupied. Holy uh, crap. Let's turn the audio. Yeah, my audio is real loud. Um, get to the vegetable wife. <laughs> D D Dylan. I think that's Dylan. Um, but yes, this is a new, the introduction of the color uh, sky in Gears of War. They did this in 3. Did they? I, I've totally forgotten 3. I spent the least amount of time with it. I mean, I didn't finish it, but like the first area is all outdoors. But I... I like green. For a bit of context for us, we were all working together, um, well, almost Dave, but all working at ga video game websites, and Gears was one of the, I think, one of those things that like waved the flag of the new generation of games. Yeah. Like, this is what they yeah. can do, and we all were charmed. Is this like uh, 2006? First yeah. one? Yeah, it's yeah. gonna be 10 years old in a few weeks. Um, but yeah, the first real big Xbox 360 exclusive, mm -hmm. um, pushing the multiplayer, pushing the concept of Xbox Live. Oh, I will turn on, on subtitles, people. On 360. Xbox haven't been around since, what, 04, I guess, on the original Xbox, but... Yeah, um, like, most uh, most everything on the 360 was, like, ports at that point. Should you get lot. on PS2? Like, like, outside of Oblivion in early 06 and things like Chrome Hounds, like, it, it was... There wasn't a whole lot that first year, and Gears... Yeah was the start of the real 360 mm -hmm. uh, kind of coming into its own. Around the launch of the PS3, strangely enough. Um, it's right, Triscuitable. Gears 4 has many colors. It's just like the, blue, well... green, red, and not I red. forget how the story ends. I tried to read up on it. The emulsion is gone, and so are allegedly the Locust, and now the Cog has set up people in these little confines to hide from those windstorms, um, and these guys are scavengers, outliers. All Malcolm Reynolds. Uh, I cannot believe how much the lead character sounds like uh, <laughs> Nathan Nolan North. Um, By the way, I also bought the game today at Best Buy, and because I pre-ordered it, I got this cool mug. Nice. Which was a topic on uh, this week's bonus time. You and the other hobos can gather around the barrel yeah. fire. And look, it does have that look of, uh, <laughs> of like having a uh, castor oil in it to make yeah. you pee, make you. Can you grab me that? Co co this I'm actually That's jealous of, to be honest. That is, it's got the Goonies logo on it, nah. and it's like it's like solid. The coaster is, is pretty great. It's I, like, I can't complain. It's like gym mat, like uh, <laughs> yeah, consistency. And I'm gonna I'm gonna christen it, of course, with a Gears of War Rockstar Energy Drink. Man. I cannot believe how long I spent looking for those. So I usually get like energy drinks on the weekend, and I'm like, I got gears. I want to get them points because uh, I'll show you. Hopefully, we can show yeah, you, you get, horde like, mode. Extra skins, dude. Unlocking shit in this game is really hard. Um, I'm a bit bummed out by because I basically feel like I bought this Ultimate Edition for horde mode alone, and it's. Really great. It just has some disappointing aspects to it that I don't know. I don't know if they can be fixed. Did you? Uh, did you redeem the last one I gave you? Uh, no, I haven't done it yet. All right. Well, giving you this one too. Didn't mm -hmm. you get it too? Don't you want the skins? I, I've. Does everybody I, remember the invisible, invincible, uh, hacking, welding robot from the first one huh. that uh, yes. couldn't be hurt or killed, and it's like black box style. Why didn't you build the whole Gears of War out of that? <laughs> So I'm going it's to. It's the only thing that can do that. Apparently. There are some new things. I think this is new. I didn't play Judgment, but like you know, obviously you can take cover up against stuff like that. Uh, but you can run and now leap over stuff now to move a little bit faster. God, it's corroding the cup. <laughs> <laughs> it's made of stainless steel, but somehow it's burning through. See, I'm keeping my sprint going. It's a little hard to steer. Gears is like an old truck. Ugh. But yeah, taking the level, it looks very pretty, right? 
Yeah, I mean, this is the first game from Coalition, uh, the, the studio right. formed or ac ac acquired to build Gears of War games. Um, who did, who did Phil Judgment? Uh, I don't know. I want to say maybe Epic did that as well, or maybe it was just Black Tusk. Um, mm. But they're now called The Coalition. They're Microsoft Vancouver and Black Tusk. Uh, but this is their first real uh, big solo Gears of War game set in the main time frame. I do love this setting, though. A bunch of robots that ignore me. There are no people here. Oh no, wait, let me turn on some subtitles. Oh, yeah. That's JD. Do you want me to tell? Do you want me to I'm tell JD. you his last name? Phoenix. <laughs> JD Phoenix. Uh, um, uh. Let me see. Where's my fucking subtitles? Mature content. Crank, I did crank it all the way. Up. I don't know why more games don't do that, but I'm not going to turn it on. Gears had a uh, non m rated version where sparks flew out instead of blood. Yeah. It. it yeah. Revive me, need? darn it! Does Ice T reprise his role as providing the soundtrack to Gears? Y'all bunch of pussies. <laughs> he said that to me. Not me. That's not what he said. No, I I may have been been wrong there. I like. Y'all a bunch we, of pussies. He, he, I care he now. Said we were, you guys made me care. <laughs> he either called us all pussies or called us all the other f word. I think I want to say pussies because I think he's a little he's aware enough to not say the other one, but. I could. I I was drunk at that party too, mm. but I do remember like really? we're all playing the video game because that's what we're paid to do, and he's angry at us because we're not paying attention to dead his sick track body list? count. <laughs> <laughs> Ten years ago, uh, Megadeth frontlined the Gears of War launch party Indeed with their hit do. song "Gears of War." The the Gears Let me see if I can pull one of the new maneuvers. Uh, these are just oh no, he got me! Ooh. Yeah, you can now vault over stuff. Oh. My Lancer. Somehow filling a mug full of energy drink makes it less appetizing. <laughs> Sorry, I love me my Lancer, and I forget you don't start out with it. You have a gun called the Snu. <laughs> I don't know what this. This is the, as far as I can tell, either it's the only new gun in the game, or the only gun I've never used before in any Gears game. Yeah, the only thing uh, more fun than. Actually, there's nothing fun about shooting robots. I'll just cut to the chase there. Well, if you don't like that, then you might not like the game because these comprise a lot of the enemies in the game. And Horde mode, which is fine because Still I basically just want to shoot a gallery. Is fine. Like, yeah, it's a shooting gallery. Galaga, basically. It's like, that's funny. But I'll, I'm going to try and skip people to... Uh, I'll try and skip the stream to some locusts later on. But I wanted to show you this environment first because I thought it was... Uh, one of the biggest and not necessarily gearsy environments I've ever seen. It's it's Sarah recovering from the events of the original trilogy, right? Mm -hmm. The the sky is no longer black Ooh. and red. Wow, that is a good looking sky. And I can easily leap over stuff without double tapping A. Um, see. Um, Skidville says the Macarza is from Judgment. Macarza is from Judgment. Yeah, that's I, I kind of regret not ever. That's the only gears in my head. Some of the multiplayer played. at an event or something. But here but. it's like it kind of takes a lot of cues from um, Bulletstorm ah, and like because it's that developer. Uh -oh. So this is a new maneuver, I, I believe. Again, didn't play Judgment. I can hold forward, pull this guy over the ledge, and it's it's not a, that's not an uncommon act in Gears of War. You'll be up against the same barrier your enemy will be. Shocking. Oh, what the hell? That active reload. Hit it, I and mean, I watched it skirt right past it. Is that the thing like when you shoot a free throw and look back at your hands when you miss the basket? Kobe! Like, whose hands are these? I, I didn't miss that. Green light. Uh, so yeah, I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of this. I can actually, I, I do love, I do love this stage. You know, like robots working and not interfering with me. These guys could kick the shitter to me. Get away uh, from her, smart you Ash bitch. Ash asks, is this the game's frame rate or the streams? I'm going to guess this Probably is the, the streams. streams. The game's frame rate is, is pretty great. It's especially solid uh, 43 Xbox One. frames per second. Yeah, they went, <laughs> they went unconventional with 43 frames. I love this. Check this out. Boom! These little Aww. things rush you. You can just kick them across the field. Why do you do that? They look so nice. If they suck, they'll explode and create this electrical barrier around you. You want them like, away from you. I like, I like the, the little tick. Nah, whatever. Yeah, I like the ticker. Ah! Oh, I missed it. See? Because that'll happen. Now I, I can't move while that's happening. My team of fire says, if Chris's life was a QTE, there would always be a press XTN button. Uh. Does it? Well, we're the thousand. The YouTube people should uh should enjoy the hell out of this. You can thank American Internet for this problem, by the way. There are some real bad problems with my internet. Um, in addition to my Xbox Live, so we'll see. We'll see if I can even do that because I want to show you guys Horde, but Xbox Live like. Shit the bed in a brand new way that I've never experienced before. I gotta get some cover. Yeah, someone's hit song. <laughs> what? 
Xbox Live, parentheses, hit the bed in, in a big the, new way. In a big new way. I cannot hit this active right. reload, hit man. Hit the bed, parentheses, in a big new way. I don't know. You guys got favorite Gears weapons? Because I love that Lancer, and like, almost nobody uses them in yeah. uh, Horde. And I'm they, like, I love this. It's so great. Do they have the Retro Lancers still? Yeah. The, one, the knifey one? Mm-hmm. What else did it like? I, mean, I don't remember any other weapon. I remember a shotgun yeah. that was like hilariously overpowered, and then uh, Lancer. And Kevin Nasher. <laughs> you know, I never got to use it, but that like giant uh, machete. Mm -hmm. That was pretty cool. Is that in three? Oh, yeah. 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 oh yeah, there's. So it didn't make sense. It was like you can only swing this twelve times. Why? <laughs> like, Even if you are spies. I know you've got to like balance the game out, but like, why would this thing break out there so many? So I'm sorry if you guys aren't seeing the frame rate on the Twitch channel. It's, it is really pretty. It looks very good. Yeah, it's fine. It, it runs clean. I don't, I don't know the frame rate. Yeah, the only thing I... It's just that, like, this is... It's unremarkable because it's kind of just gears. Um, the dialogue's fine. It's not ever bad, but it's never exceptional. Yeah. And, and having... I, I really liked Unshorted 4 thinking it had nothing else to offer. Uh, gaming, and I, I was very surprised by it in the way I'm, I'm not wowed by Gears 4. Um, <laughs> why, why? Uh, Franklin Man says, Woo, yeah, come on, sucker. This is my kind of stream. Uh, this is also my kind of shit. Got it. There we go. Some, uh, getting that active time reload now. Let's see if I can pull this asshole over I don't his know why I it spoiled for me because <laughs> I never finished Gears 3, but, uh, where's culture? Uh, you know what? I have not seen him in the story mode, but somebody in Horde was playing as Coltrane. So, so even um, if he's not canonically loved, I can. Still I mean, play that's him. the nature of this game. It's going to have such a. It's going to have a much bigger life online than it is uh, in the campaign. Um, I'm sure you can get old Phoenix, new Phoenix, um, Phoenix, dark Phoenix, wearing Idol Master clothes. Oh, bitch. Phoenix DX. Ah, wow. That was a direct headshot, you fucking robot. They think a robot's gonna also have screens in its head. That's why your robot never works. Nah. <laughs> no Simpsons references here. What? Uh, oh. So what are these robots doing? They're guarding the facility, and I, 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 did, did I wanted to. we build a college for them, and now they're uh, now they're rebelling against. I sort of groaned when I saw them because they are like hyper generic robots, and there are a lot of them. But they're so. Good. I couldn't tell if it was on purpose cheesy, but they just announced reloading, <laughs> firing, and like it, it just started to make me laugh. I'm pretty sure it's on purpose. They're supposed to be dumb, dumb robots. Oh, shit. Yeah, they don't have to turn anything. Um, Chimp asks, any Oops. famous D-listers on the voice uh, cast list? Uh, I mean, I thought Run the Jewels is in the game somewhere. Mm. Can, I call them up-and-comers, not D-listers. Mm. That's uh, the, the popular iPhone game, right? <laughs> You jewel runner? Robots, You're a jewel like, runner. You would assume the robots oh, are hello. connected via some sort of hive mind or Wi-Fi yeah. network thing where they would not need to verbally announce their Hey, oh, cut cover me. It should be like, I have already told you at the speed of light hmm. what I what my I'm gonna assume Command Nine Gianni is. I mean if you can hear them, they're announcing their mode and what they're gonna do <laughs> and in like the up. That is kind yeah. of a gear straight. They yeah. announce when they're reloading so you fine. you know when to pop out of cover. You know, when uh, What's-His-Nuts goes BOOM, you get the fuck out of there, because he's yeah. about to fire on you. Yeah. And that's it's fine. that's why, like, when the, the game is the best for me when it's not trying to tell me a story of any yeah. kind. Yeah, when um, it's just a shooting gallery with a bunch of, uh, I mean, it's still a tube that you progress through and uh, shoot yeah. the cardboard cutouts when they pop up, but with a great production value and a lot of cool effects. So, so you guys tell me when you want me to move on and meet Marcus. Uh, um, so Tenga says, sorry to take us off track. Oh, Literally off track. Uh, loved hearing about Fast and Furious uh, on Laser Time, but I'm That's sorry, right. Tokyo Drift is worse than the fourth fourth film. Again, it's it's a grim thing for loving cars and and like yeah, of coming off of part two being mostly CG car stuff. Like you can't appreciate it as a good car movie. Yeah, but I remember like being angry at the third. I don't mm -hmm. know why I wasn't that big a fan of Fast and Furious, but I just remember being like, there's nobody from from the first two in this. Man, they really lost it. But then you watch it nowadays, and it's like. It's got, than four. It's great. It, it, I mean, it's mostly natural effects. Or, I mean, not a lot of uh, CGI. And it's beautiful because it's in Japan. Go it's like a totally turn, different yeah. look for the series. It's like I would yeah, argue yeah. don't watch either of them. But three yeah. became important. Yeah, and it uh, also is it's, like, it's, it's surprisingly important now. And yeah, again, would be a shooter shooting. without propaganda posters. And, but uh, four is just, I just <laughs> Up to hate. three. The CGI is just like, I 
can't get over it. Yeah, so it's much not a good look. CGI. Mm -mm -mm. This thing and they're driving in lane tunnels. Yeah, a lot of boring tunnels, and I don't know. But oh, so Tenka is right. Like uh, Lucas Black is a really bad protagonist. Yes, yeah, yes, he's, he's a bad not, actor as well. Not, yeah, not good. I mean, I would do no better in that in that <laughs> position, so I can't talk. But the Triskelion, meanwhile. Uh, frankly, man says I watched Raw. You could have cemented <laughs> laser time with a run-in on exactly Roman Reigns. Yeah, yeah. Someone but that said I should have given you an Antista 316 sign. You know what? Uh, that, well, uh, that, that, I, I was like, you know what sign I would have actually brought? Now I think of it, just someone that said Alfred Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, it's Alfred Chicken. Because that's like how uh, Dan Riker brings right, the, the sign that says Waluigi, Waluigi to WrestleMania, yeah. and then everyone's tweeting at him like, I love they made that sign. It's like, Oops. man, we could have done it for Alfred Chicken. Yeah. We could have been. But I just love yeah being there, and it was like I don't know. So it seems like the internet thought that it was a, an all right raw for the most part. But it wasn't, it wasn't hugely mo mo like momentous or anything. I mean, but I it, was it was fun. It was a great one to be at live, yeah. and then I think in the grand scheme of raws mm. for the past month or two, it was pretty good. Yeah. Kill it! And we uh, like Reigns actually had a good a good Heads match up, in that. All led up to the one spear that was like, wow, that was a great spear. Like one of his like, best spears ever. Seen. Yeah, and like it was like, yeah, that was fun. Now get him out of here. And then he left. My favorite part though was uh, we, we mentioned it on, I think I tweeted about it, but we'll talk about it more on Cheap Hopcast. Yeah. Uh, on patreoncom time, you know. But uh, the kid in front of us who was a super big Reigns fan, and when the whole arena started doing Reigns, the kid looked like the whole world of <laughs> And it was like a Santa Claus thing where you're like, oh, fuck. Is oh god, that's bad. That's, like it's same thing at WrestleMania where like revive you know, me. We were booing uh, Cena when he's yeah. facing. Uh, Rusev. Rusev. So you got a kick and then in the by ear. the end of the match, we had convinced the kid to be, like who was John Cena. Yeah. Well, oops, oops. The kid left early, anyway. Did he? Yeah, the parents got up and left. Um, Ooh, so we were early. It was in the main wow. event too, so it's like you made it till 7:45, but 8 o'clock, absolutely. It's like there's something to beat traffic, but like you're missing the oh. main event. Which is not the main event. It doesn't. So this is still pretty early in the game. This it is, is after, but, but like, like I can't. I'm not saying it as an insult. This is the game. This yeah. is for like the next. This is what you'll be doing for the next yeah. few hours. You'll be wandering around and killing these exact same Did robots. You find any cool bosses yet? Um, no, not yet. I can. Ju you want me to jump you guys to Phoenix? You got? Are you done seeing the, the light level? Yeah, I like. I mean, I, well, you're the guy. Oh, you should tell right, us right, when I'll, you're. I'll bounce us out of here. We'll go meet Marcus. Um, meeting Marcus. I'm still kind of bummed I didn't miss a thing. Two to wrestling, says Sotanga. Hmm. Yeah, we uh, have the thing up now on lasertime.bandcamp.com hmm. and, and the commentary you can also get by being a patron. Patron on patreon.com. I can't speak. Yeah, um, we, watched, uh, we had to watch The Thing uh, earlier than our normal scheduled time. But watching The Thing at noon was very strange. Note, I'm kicking this shit on normal, by the way. No, no casuals. No casies oh. here. I don't know if normal is the thing to brag about. I normally brag about kicking it's it up. It's the thing to do. Um, Kick it up or not. It sounds like Robocop is yelling at you, says Nuke Ninja. Yeah, I think that was sort of the point. Um, but I don't know. Did anybody else pick this up? I had. I'm going to talk about this on Video Game Apocalypse maybe a little more in depth, but I, I was a little bummed. I'm like, hey, guys, I'm playing Horde. Come play with me. I have hundreds of people on my friends list. There was one person playing Gears. Nobody tweeted me, like, you want to play? Like, I didn't think. I don't think anybody was playing it yesterday. Oh, we're up to act two of Gears. It wasn't, like, super actually out until today, anyway. Until, so. well, last night at, like, midnight. Um, right, but again, you gotta be, like, super on it to have gotten it then and bothered what? to turn it on. Like, I think the better test would be today. Hmm. Well, we moved on from that time. Uh, Pasta Bird says, normal is casual. You're not necessarily wrong about that, because um, in Horde mode, I had to bump it up a little bit because I was doing a little too well. Um, but I'm also really good. Home. Uh, we patrons sure. need to vote Ernest Scared Stupid for the last week of October. Can we tease how we were going to do that? Like, the That's first vote over. was, like, everybody in on, yeah, on the Patreon gets to suggest movies. We distill it down to five. Then we, we vote. Like and we were like, well, the next vote should be the, the the favorites of ours that we yeah. want to watch. So if Elston wants to throw Scared Stupid in... I don't, have you even seen it? Of course I've seen it. How many times? Probably only once. Well, he was oh. fix the place up. And I thought this would be fun. Change my mind. I want to see how far I could kick the bucket through the game. So. There's got to be an achievement, like, kick this bucket through six levels. Oh, that'd be great. Well, at some point you're going to get a hard-loading screen, and that bucket's well, going to not it, be part of the trip. If you're a Serious Gears fan, you recognize this as the Phoenix Estate. Or I guess it's not called the Phoenix Estate. It looks like the textures haven't loaded on that bucket yet. Oh, yeah. Like, 
can't even run. I might as well kick the bucket. Come on, guys. Uh, Triskatable says, spoiler coming at, up, watch your ears and subtitles. Not why? Oh. Well, it's a, you know, if you if someone just got the game and they want they haven't gotten to this part of the campaign. It, it was when I previewed this on Twitch, it was literally in the trailer they spoiled it for everybody. Uh, yeah, that's true. Well, not yeah. I got I yes, technically there's a spoiler coming up, but um it's already in the YouTube image. So yeah, Phoenix has chosen to live outside of Cog settlements. Um just it's sitting the here with Stroud my, estate. My bad, Triscuit. With my boots laced up and my giant belt. Uh, All my textures are on. Yeah. I got my fingerless gloves hey, on. Hey, we have a that's similar color. That's oh, the wow. mug. Hey. How did he know? Not that new. Dad. Yeah, I have the logo of my own oh, game on my card. Smikey says this game does it's look super pretty. Yeah, it's. Dill, you win this too. It's just it's been Wait. so long since Gears Three. It like you five years, I think. Yeah, five or six. Now, you know that I I couldn't. Five and a half. My <laughs> memories of Gears are pretty glowing. It's looking pretty good, but I I know this looks better. It looked good, but it never. It always was like running at like mm. uh, okay. Mm. It would chug. And that's a lot. right. I, I played. Sorry, I did play Gears of War Ultimate. Also by the Coalition, the uh, remaster, and that was 60 frames a second. What did you do? So Jenga says, "How old is Marcus in Jake the Dog years?" The cog will hunt you down again. <laughs> I don't know how old he is in like human years. So yeah, in the same month he's played but both ceremonial played, Nickelodeon guts trophy. He's played Jake the Dog and Marcus Phoenix mm -hmm. in video games. Yeah, and, uh, and games he streamed. A, I didn't didn't get to get it in Futurama. There's a Futurama episode where they find Finn and Jake. Huh. And uh, yeah, the DiMaggio yeah, also does Jake to Bender. God damn it, James. Uh, Skittle says it's like they're the only one surprised that more robot show. I do love uh, this that the uh, politician official military leader shows up. Whoa. That looks like a WW2K17 wrestler with the no <laughs> yes, painted on face. Triscuitable Marcus in the game is roughly 64, 65. This does place, take place at least a, a dozen years after the events of They should call this game Gears of War 64. Hmm. Uh, Triscuitable points out that the actual spoiler is something that Marcus says after he gives Kate her armor. Oh. So maybe when you see that scene about to start, if you're watching and you don't want to hear it, just means this takes place in the Halo universe. <laughs> you certainly know a lot about this story. Night yeah, Fire says, put your Legend of Dimensions Jake car on the Xbox and see what happens. We should close out any uh, uh, WordPress oh, website I've opened there. Uh, does Marcus have nanobots? And also Marcus. Right now. Um... <laughs> Wow, it's like the animatronics at Disney parks at JGB Sterling. The game takes place almost 30 years after Gears of War 3. My bad. When does Judgment take place then? Because, yeah, I guess we've never met JD then. Nice to see you still have a way with people, Marcus. Just head for the back door. Do love the new <laughs> leap feature. Fight my shiny metal ass. Oh, hi. Hi, Wait, were the robots you saw in the previous level like training robots, or were they also that? Got them both. Oh god. Uh, they were they were uh, guarding the city. Not not so much assault robots, but they're they're essentially the same. These ones have red lights, and the other ones. Are... And I do believe headshots still apply to them. Oh, that was a, that's bad cover. That's bad cover. Um, is it Bastion from Overwatch? No, it just has this like Lost Planet two or three thing. I can't quite tell if Phoenix was in Lost Planet two, so maybe that's the uh, mental leaps I'm making. MLG, MLG. Uh oh, oh fuck! Says, there's a guy behind uh, me. Speaking of WWE two K seventeen, there's some kind of hard drive wiping bug in it, so be careful. Yeah. Is there? That's uh, John Cena's new finisher. <laughs> uh, Isn't that the person? achievement ruiner. Hi. <laughs> Uh, oh, Mr. Sloan says, uh, this is dream casting for the upcoming Universal Gears of War film, but it's got to be The Rock. Yeah? Oh, yeah? The did. Rock is the... He will do anything. He's the human most built like a Gears of War character. That's true. Yeah. He is top-heavy AF. Well, I like that uh, the game does start out, if you can tell. It's it's showing you um, that these are not hyper-built people. Uh, maybe use my Nasher on him. Well, nobody looks hyper-built compared to Marcus Phoenix. 
got the ultimate triangle torso. I take it these yeah. are Jin's new toys. Yeah, we've been playing with them all day. Come on, follow me upstairs. Sure. What's upstairs? <laughs> Family heirlooms. Ooh. Pua. This is your house, Marcus. Jesus. Here's my copy of Earthbound. <laughs> so let's clean the house. Appreciated in value over 400 years. Frankly, man, I st each of these robots have their own small resonators. <laughs> it's all about the fabricator now, guys. The resonator is so 2006. More of them up here. This little says, "Nice, it still got the old dudes are dead guitar." <laughs> Ambar. Yeah, I, I don't. I'm not that familiar with that weapon, but I can give it a shot. Yeah. Uh, Battle Royal Memorial. Uh oh, it's only got three bullets, so you know it's good. You fuck it up, I'm not careful. <laughs> Rendell says, "This is my podcast room. No one goes in there." Phoenix, do something. God. There you go. Oh no, my ammo is low. What's the boy to do? What do I do? God, I'm teasing something. Actually, this game is still rated M. I'm, I'm assuming that later on you start killing people again. Mm -hmm. Cause, yeah, because yeah. the, the, the whole killing robots thing is its usually a thing that happens yeah. when a game wants to be rated. Oh, oh. My, the girl, my breastplate. Girls don't get their shoulders. I call yeah. breastplate. <laughs> yeah, he's a it's open game on lady shoulders. I feel like this game is rated T since you're shooting at robots yeah, now. Juice Kaboos, I had the same feeling, but there's a lot of disgusting shit coming in, coming your way. Fire. Enjoy this gun. It's technically 50 years old and not as effective <laughs> as any weapon you've got And, and requires gas. <laughs> <laughs> you got plenty of gas left, right? Yeah. Ain't that a hole in the bowl? Let me get that. Kind of feels like I'm wearing a door. Grab her in the pussy. I'm supposed to. Didn't get your name. Kate. <laughs> Jay Philosophy. What's upstairs, Marcus? Uh, My amiibos. Need if you wanna Huh. Don't wanna hear a spoiler, I guess. Right what? Now. Is there a spoiler? Yeah, to my mother. Mother. We can skip it. Oh. Is that the spoiler? Oh, what's that? Just calling in a favor. Speaking of favors, Look at me so phoenixy. Probably want this back. Thanks. It's Silver so. Fox now. Alright. Time to introduce Yay. Yay. Yeah. Thanks for the head texture. And clear these bucket heads out of my house. Whoa. This is nice. So, I did I did like this moment. Like it's my arsenal. Feel free to take any weapon you want. Um mm. well, for Stallone says hashtag locker room gears talk. Huh. And it's it's I'm a bread and butter I'm a meat and potatoes guy. I like me some Lancer. Ooh, there's a retro lancer. Why, why, what's so fun is about the retro re lancer? Is there two different forms of retro lancer. Um, or... well, they call this one a custom lancer. I don't know why. I maybe maybe your skittable nose. Um, Looks like they're two different knifey. But yeah, of, you can uh, select any weapon you want basically and move forward in the game. Um, oh shit! They're through the wall. They've been doing it all day. Yes, I love it. Like every bit of dialogue, it treats that like a surprise. Like you're not being a uh, you're not in a cock gun being pushed into more enemies. Dad, what's the plan here? We gotta get to my truck. <laughs> and at first, I thought like all of these, all these grunty like ways of speaking in these Gears games were jokes. But then I heard Alex Jones. Like everyone in this game sounds like they're doing an Alex Jones impression. Ah, making the frogs game. All right, so the tip. Oh wow, he shot down. Hard and on bleeding blood. That demon is a demon. <laughs> So why... What's up? I'm trying to figure out why these people are fighting you, but... Because, man, I won't obey the COGS rule, dude. What a terribly built helicopter that blows this week from. Hey, she's pulling out! Is that it? You're not pregnant! I don't think Get so. to the Dodge Resonators <laughs> <laughs> philosophy. Again, it's all about the fabricator, you know. Are you kidding me? Those robots come out of the like, Kinder Eggs. <laughs> <laughs> That's a active time reload boost, everybody. You sure you want to peek out of this corner? Annihilate all of you. Love my Lancer. Take 
cover. Franklin Man says, in Gears 4, the twist is the resonator trying to get to you. <laughs> <laughs> That's in Russia. Where the hell is she going? Tenga pointed out something that we just discovered. A Cuphead's delayed to 2017. That's crazy. Whoa, well, whoa. we're playing 2016's most anticipated game. That's uh, now 2017's most anticipated Xbox One game. So I'm sure they'll be in another game. Whoa! Ooh. That was a that was a missile to the face. Don't worry, I can. Su oh goodness, I can survive a missile. It's fine. Two well, missiles, I, as long as my friends kiss me. That's Thank asking you. a bit much. The one. That was not MLG. Hug me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well I'm in here. Why not stock up? And I'm sure there's a better weapon to take care of this, but I want to. Right now. Do you still have the E bar or arm bar or yeah. whatever it was. It's more of a sniper rifle. Mm -hmm. Thing. It's a, it, uh, well, you know, it's stronger. like if you miss a shot on the engine, you're fucked. Um, yeah, but it seems when it's still, it's pretty still. Yeah, but look how great I am with the Lancer. Firing off out of nowhere. I'd say that is I'm doing very poorly with the Lancer. Which little says that the helicopter has lost planet glowing weak spots. Yeah, but all, all things in Gears of War do. Nothing wrong with that. Ah! I mean, again, I'm never ha more happy with this game when it's behaving like a video game. Oh. What? Well, shit. Hmm. So, uh, Dad, the cog is still after us. Your truck just blew up, and the house is on fire. Some Chris Pratt. Is there a plan B? Yeah, there's a It does kind of sound B. like him. But. It's Nathan Cillian. Grab some ammo and let's get out. He just sounds too. He sounds and looks too much like Nathan Drake to me. He went. He at least went to the Nathan Drake school of voice acting. Dad. Citizens, you are in an illegal area. Oh. What the hell is an illegal area? Behind the wall. This guy will run at you and explode. Will you leave me, at least leave me his fucking try shot? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I really do love the heavy weapons in the game. You know, I know my least favorite Gears gun is what? the mortar down. ones. I never yeah. can, I can never figure out. I actually have not encountered those. It reminded me of one of my Mass Effect multiplayer characters. Uh, yeah, that was fun, but got a I got an absurd in one of the blind box things. Mm -hmm. An absurd Gatling gun. Uh, that came with a holographic oh. shield in front of it, mm -hmm. and then had a shoulder-mounted missile launcher, and then just let me walk in a straight line just like out of Predator, <laughs> and just Let's get to my cellar. I've got a nice Pinot Grigio down here. <laughs> it's full of Sprite, Vern. Just follow me. I attached eight houses and called it mine. <laughs> For emergencies. So Tanga says, is there a mod to make Marcus and JD sound like Hank and Bobby Hill? <laughs> Good, that would have done now. Frag out! Guys, stop it. <laughs> Damn. What's a resonator? Instead of being a cog, I want to be in a beauty patch. Me, Dad. Get out of here. We'll deal with that. Now, come on. Bobby, this is an Ill illegal area. Ah! Oh, they're all toilet grunts. <laughs> with any luck, Jin will think we didn't make it out of that. I sell emulsion and emulsion accessories. <laughs> Can my ventriloquist dummy be in the gears? <laughs> Bob, no. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! We have hit, hit full Phoenix. The lighting is pretty cool in this section. Yeah, it is pasta bird. Again, a very pretty game. <laughs> Randolph says, they've been whacking off on my gun <laughs> shit. <laughs> whacking off. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's Selling Mr. Anderson. It's a different character. Selling propane galaxy five. Cavity searches. A lot of them. Hi. Robots. Stop shooting my friends! Let's see if I can execute this asshole. <laughs> God damn it! Halabaster, get to the resonator! Says Franklin. Uh. This is a great when robots are programmed to, uh, 
have dying Extreme. gestures as they fall down. <laughs> Why was I programmed to feel? The programmed pain. Why was I programmed <laughs> to mimic this behavior? Uh, Ghost Little says, already sick of shooting these robots. We need some squishy locust freak monsters. Um, well then hang on. We should be able to show you those. Um, if I can remember where to go. Uh, you gotta collect that wood, bring it inside. Make it fire. Hey, another sentinel. Love these things. Oh, it's just made Sasha back sunglasses. Ah. <laughs> hey, reload. So I think I put in like a... Over a dozen hours. Oh god, that's too close. Uh, Night Humidifier says, That's my Lancer! I don't know you! <laughs> I like the noises oh these things make. Yeah. Oh god. Zitching. Classic excuse. <laughs> oh, where's your nose? Oh, they're shooting out blood like. Uh, liquids from that's their body. The, that's the Castrol difference, Dave. Ah. <laughs> See, the, the character's name is Kestrel, and I make it Castrol. <laughs> oh god, that's bad. Ah. It's this asshole to take down. Yeah, you're done. You're done. Oh, I love that. I don't remember if the Sen Sentinels have been in other games. Uh, don't argue with me. Antimunifier says, why does that robot shield look like Bret Hart's sunglasses? <laughs> it's just taunting uh, Bret. Such a bad time, ill-timed nose -ish. I was going through, like, a, a old messages, and I saw this message from Hitman Productions. Uh -huh. And I was like, what the hell is Hitman Productions? Like, I didn't, I don't, I don't play, I haven't played any Hitman games. Mm -hmm. I didn't sign up for some... Log in to Hitman Productions to get sick loot. I was like, what so rejected is this? Mega Man boss. And then I opened it. It's like, oh right, that's the Hitman Heart uh, sunglasses fiasco yeah, that is still not. Well, it did tomato. resolve, and I got shipped back to Canada two years after I ordered them. Let me just fall beside me. Yeah, we'll find out. Another Condor. Does ask uh, any new gameplay go. mechanics? Yeah, I'll see if I can show you some of them. They did it failed at it last time, but I do love that when you sprint, you can now easily vault over things by holding B. Um, if I can maybe run over here and attempt to show you something and not get murdered. Oh, fuck me. There we go. Oh, yes. Pull a guy over. You can perform an execution. However, unlike chainsaw kills, like you don't seem to have invincible frames while you're doing that stuff. Oh, that was yeah, a good it seems idea. like a weird, make a weird thing. Like you pull them over, but it's like you're still taking hits. And then it's like, and now follow up with something that else. Was, there was supposed to be a lengthy uh, animation there. Oh. Man, if you're this close, you need a shotgun. I know, I didn't get one. Oh. Uh. Can you still do the... Gone away from my friend. The grenade uh, tag? I don't remember how. What was uh, that? If you pull the grenade out, you could just, <coughs> I think you hit B and you just basically... <laughs> oh, really? Can you throw that backwards? Uh, there's only certain grenades. I don't think the... I do like the overkill. Here, grenade. this is a shotgunny-esque weapon. Uh, Smikey? Smikey? Mm. Smikey. Smikey. Uh, says, I love uh, Marcus oh. Phoenix's passion over tomatoes. There's yeah. a lot of tomatoes in here. That's, that's one of the funnier lines in the game as well. For real. Um, alright. Kill him and see if I can perform an next... <laughs> my tomatoes! I think he did say, like, something along the lines of get my, your hands off my fucking tomatoes. You dead? Crazy. Okay, let's give this a shot. Millions. Fuck! I missed! <laughs> Big whiff from whatever this character's name is. JD. Oh man, it's all over. Well, I was trying to show you some new mechanics. This might not have been the best place for it. Nor I, the best player. I don't know what place would be if it isn't in battle with enemies. Oh, oh it's the butt! The crotch saw. Right in the robot. <laughs> you kick him in the ass. Alright, I'm gonna fucking execute this guy. God! There we go. And then, Y button. Oh, he was owned. And again, it's weird. You, you kind of can take hits during that. Come on. I mean, yeah. I mean, hmm. I it's, it's, a point, it's, it's just pointless to, like, nitpick because it doesn't matter. It's a game. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be fun, but we're... It's just weird, like, There's shiving a, a robot, and it's like, and down he goes. It's like, is there any important shit right here for the uh, robot to, like, be shoved robot. and fall down? And, like, I give up. I'm just supposed to act human when I get stabbed. Like... Oh no! 
I, I get you could cut wires. Oh, we got a wind like, flare coming in. And Everyone, back to the doesn't. greenhouse now. No, the barrel shed is better sheltered. <laughs> There's no going stay. back in Gears of War. The nothing is upon us. Mm -hmm. The engine has already overwritten that part of the game. Yep, All this right, war keep my inside. barrels. Hey, help me with this. To open a door? This isn't a two-man job. How did we cancel out of that? <laughs> um. So I assume it's still four-player uh, co-op, right? No, I don't. I actually come heard on, it's not. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's Drop fine with me. I don't. Two-player co-op. I would rather do that. It's. Not very easy for people our age to get two player co op together. Oh god, a sentence in the building! When we tried four, it just took a lot of doing. And then the game scales mm -hmm. for four, but it's like, it seems like you're supposed to play. So we have to have some of um, But two worked so good in one and two that I, I'm fine to pick this one. Gotta take this asshole down! I like how the tip of the gun heats up as you. Oh yeah. Go for their uh, magazine. Hey, you got the uh, <laughs> the active reload. Did I? Oh, didn't see him. Uh, Please die. And I can go here and try and pull heavy weapons off the sentinels. This can be kind of a pain, but I'm used to it in horde mode. Ugh. Not letting up. We gotta move. No, Ew, this place is old man stinks. This goes little. I just call these the Simpson streams. <laughs> practically all we do anyway. Make Simpsons references. Are you sure about that? It'll hold. Watch Twist! Don't listen to him, Marcus. You have an enchanting must. <laughs> uh, I was gonna say, I don't think you should be flying in this. If these storms are notoriously uh, problematic, Man. I'd be getting the H out of T. Some well timed lightning. That was pretty cool. Ah, shit! <laughs> My cans! <laughs> you guys ever watch Lost? <laughs> Sweet, this plane fell in the exact tube configuration of a Gears of War stage. <laughs> How fortuitous. <laughs> I was gonna build my own too, but this is perfect. <laughs> A perfect level. Nice. Um, but yeah, as long as you're in the game itself, the loads are pretty great. Yeah, it's just there yeah but that initial one is a doozy. It is a doozy, and um, I'm gonna show you some horde in a bit. Um, let's see what we can do. Uh, Skittle says that these storms are so bad. Why did the outsiders make freaking villages made out of wood and build homes <laughs> on mountains? Uh, well, they're, I think they're rebuilding. Yeah, I assume some. I assume this storm stuff is a recent, you know, yeah, quote-unquote recent development in the you weren't planet. At the beginning of the stream, mm -hmm. we showed you what the uh, the windproof cog places look like. They had giant solar panels to keep that stuff out. This is uh, Phoenix's old home. Ooh. Ah, get dunked. Um, I was a fan of that. Wow. Yeah. Look at that. That's a jump in Gears of War. How about that? Should probably grab it. Sniper rifle. This is the overkill, though, like a auto shotgun. It's an enormous uh, reload time. But I like it. He's a lot in horde. So, are you playing to the end of like this chunk before we go to horde, or? Yeah. Well, I was hoping I could show you a different enemy, but I don't know if I'll be able to get there in time. Um, we'll see. More robots. <laughs> These enemies are called BBs. Are they Daniel Bryan's? No, they're actually allowed in front of them. He's on the disabled list. <laughs> right when I get rid of my overkill. Oh, hi! Uh -huh, he forgot to fire at me! Oh god. I know, I know. There he goes. Don't try and do- don't try this at home. I am too good. Rockstar, I'm available for sponsorships. The drink. The drink. Okay. Definitely not the Mark Wahlberg movie, because that's terrible. I mean, we could become the number one fan uh, uh, for the movie, like tonight. That's so bad. I fucking hate that movie so much. <laughs> I 
Frankly, man asks, what does the JD stand for? Um, uh, just give a I think, has the right answer, which is James Dominic. But uh, some of the other suggestions are... Are they funnier? Spa, Spa NJ says, Judd Danger. <laughs> uh, Franklin Man says, Judge Dread. I am Judd Danger. And uh, <laughs> Nike Man Fire says, Jack Daniels. Mm. Franklin Man says, James Dean. That's Dean with an A, not James Dean, the porn star, who uh, may have raped the uh, girlfriend. Is this a big story? Yeah. I think it's actually pretty old. Well, mm. yeah, it was a couple months ago. Okay. I Running out of ammo. Uh, New Ninja says Jack Dude. All right, let's try it. Ooh, and Smitey points out that Catherine is seventy-five percent off for on the 360. It takes like five bucks, which is eight. Catherine, the puzzle slash dating store. Yeah, I know it. I love that game. I'm just more surprised that it took five to six years to beat that place. Just play that game on easy for that sake. Yeah. Frag out. Frag out. To nothing. Oh, where's my... Yeah, I really Remitters. took care of those dead robots. That's what I need. Yeah, the AI... Uh, well, Deactivated robots. My companions are kind of shit at getting anything done. Any ammo over here? No? Don't need it. Don't need it. That's one of the reasons why I like to keep the Lancer handy, because uh, especially in Horde mode, because ammo can be scarce, and no matter what, with this weapon, you still have a pretty good uh, close-range attack. Um... Family's estate, Marcus. No, it belonged to my late wife's family. Is that the spoiler? Mom loved it here. I'm just glad you didn't. It's wife's dead. Well, I think it's yeah, the piecing. Like you said, his mom. <laughs> Hi, Lisa. Thanks for doing the film commentary at 8 p.m. UK time last night. Says uh, 80s mullet. You're welcome. A name like that. Yeah, uh, no. Brent, Brent has the right answer. JD stands for Jave Dudden. <laughs> <laughs> or Pig McLarge Huge as Smart Ash. <laughs> Buff fridge meat. <laughs> Do your Kestrel exercises. Is that a Kegel reference? I think so. I yes, know. that is the spoiler. Why is that a spoiler, Triskitable? Oh, she's uh, dead. Fun, James. <laughs> sure, why? But to Aren't know you? that, oh, you'd have had to ignore... To assuming <laughs> you'd have to remember other gears. I assume that it happened. Story points. To, unless that's like a she's plot point that was introduced in this game. Slab hard cheese. Um, I mean, I, I don't know. Well, I tell you what, Triskitable, how far away are we from seeing a different enemy? You know so much. You are so Guys, smart. I see it. Oh, we're loading. How oh, good you just kicked it into your friends. <laughs> it's all about how they explode. Oh, that's a good guy. He just says, one helicopter hasn't done this much damage since Airwolf. <laughs> the crime solving. Another dropship! Oh, another dropship. Is anybody surprised? Uh, uh, Shaskidbull says you're about one act and a few chapters away. Oh, yeah, that's not going to happen. Oh, howdy. Um, sure well, I'm going to take out this load of people. More robots. Thank you very much, Shaskidbull. I'm Josh. I think I was being aggressive. I love that you love uh, Gears of War. Oh, my goodness. What's the uh, seriously counter at now? Like, the uh, kill... Was it like 50,000 the first time? They just keep upping it. Oh, seriously, the achievement? I didn't see it, actually. It's worth I looking up. Here we go. This will make short work of every... Damn it! Where's his gun? Oh, it's... There it is. Salvo. Oh, hi! Ted. Oh, hi! Oh, that's a good way to kill yourself, actually. <laughs> Randall says, if the drag cool it like this, I can connect it. Here's some 4.0. Oh. Really? Ooh, that's not the right one. Uh, just good old says, seriously, Ooh, 10 that, times, that did work. get every ribbon, beat all horde waves on every vanilla map on Insane and a few other things. What happened to just getting a lot of kills? <laughs> oh, wow, is it? It's, it's just like literally everything. Yeah. Like a platinum trophy equivalent. I mean, maybe it hasn't been like that for a while. Now, but I, I'd like it when it was just like get a shit ton of kills. Yeah. You can always just check your stats to see. Okay, now I'm a uh, 150th over there. 
Yeah, I haven't played a lot of stuff for achievements on X to the Bone, but it is it does have a handy way of showing you your progress. It is a good effect, at the very least. This thing is called the Kessler, and I want to know if anybody, any viewer out has the same association I do. Oh, I have it. What? Uh, I know you don't. Yes, I. How? Is it uh, Seinfeld? No. Oh. It's because I had to write up that entry for the Amazon thing. The American Werewolf in London. Ah. It's uh, it's the guy is uh, brought back to the hospital. Mr. Kessler, and he like, why does that guy's voice sound like that? Because it's the real life Fozzie, Frank Oz, uh, concerned about the man turning into a werewolf. Oh boy, I'm having flashbacks to Half-Life 2 helicopter boss fight. Um, I know it's a Kestrel. In the barn, Dad. Mr. The Kestrel. <laughs> I think Kessel, oh, isn't that what they called good. Kramer in the first episode? Did the, they? Uh, yeah. Guys, we got another wind flare. Already? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the game doesn't stop just because you... <laughs> Again, I shouldn't run past this. Very pretty. Very pretty. I love the uh, mountain range. Oh, yeah, Kessler was the name of uh, Kramer in the first episode. So really? Thought, yeah. There's not much shelter between us and that barn. We gotta hurry. Hmm. I'm gonna get to one more crescendo. Let me show you guys some horde. Ooh! Oh, yeah, this, is, this, this got me killed Jim's a couple got times. Now what? Let's divide their fire! James, Typical gears, which way do we go, guys? Road, riverbed. More choice. Uh, river, huh. Road will remember that. Take you take left. <laughs> We're on it. Uh, Frankly, I'm asked why build a robot helicopter in the shape of a regular helicopter that was a human. <laughs> why build a robot in the shape of a human? Yeah, you know? Extra arms, longer yeah. arms. Yeah, all this. That's why I stopped with the shivving thing where my head doesn't matter. Repeat to yourself, it's just a game. I should really just relax. Four Gears of War. Four. It's the gestures that really get me. Oh, hello. Wow. No invincible frames there. You could get murdered here. Now you're in big there we go. trouble. Uh, now, you're, uh, now you're Jesse Ventura. Watch it, sniper! It's gonna be big trouble. Ah shit! Ah shit! I feel like ah oh, shit are... is gear support. Oh no no no! Okay. Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Yeah. <laughs> Wasting my heavy weapon. How about we? Frag out! What does frag out mean? Is it frag? Is that like he's saying frag signing off? <laughs> Gobo's last line in Fraggle Rock? I'm not turning off the lights to the Fraggle Rock cave. You did see that that's coming back to HBO, right? The Master? Is the last episode of Fraggle Rock. Like, I hope it's somehow sad. Yeah, it is. Well, sort of. Like, they kind of reveal themselves. Like they know, like, the whole house is going to get demolished. And then, <laughs> because they're under it, it's like, oh, well, we're going to dig up this whole foundation. I want to give We're going to put a subway here. No, something like that. Subway restaurant. But they do reveal, they re he reveals himself to Doc, which is pretty neat. It's just, it's nice that it has an ending, like, right. at all. Mm. Rather than just being canceled and disappearing forever. Closure, let's call it. Die, everything, die. What? I'm not tired of the shit. You love it. So many robots. Uh, <clears throat> viewers are talking about the uh, frag, frag grenades and all that. Uh, and password said, "You're a frig." You're a frig. You're a cigarette. You're a gears of war. Uh oh, bad. Bad. Uh, frag out, uh, as Smikey says, is fragment. Fragmentary grenade is the toy. Oh, oh, I had no idea. Which is like, I think there are incendiary grenades in this game, but when do you have non, like, the other kind of grenades in this game? You must always have the frag. There are shock grenades. Frag yeah. I, those might be new. I don't, I don't know. I, I honestly don't like using grenades in most games. Yeah, and in, I, in Gears, it's even more inconvenient because yeah, you've really got to select it on the D pad, and then it's got that weird, like, 
I've never liked that. Like, I think that's also why I don't like the uh, the mortar thing because it's like I don't want to deal with traje trajectory now. Like, oh yeah, no, the UI watched, they would have you, for it. If you throw out a, like you throw out a nade now, look at that. I hate that. I yeah, hate that UI. The wind will push the grenade. Oh, that's yeah. cool. So Tanka says, hey there, shitty, shitty, crack, crack, shitty, shitty, crack, crack, how do you do? Nope. Nancy one says, frags out for Harambe. Hello. And I love this, when a sentinel's back is to you, you can just kind of lay into him for a no Fire upon those engines. Oh, God. Oh, bad cover there. It happens. Top five grenades in games. Hmm. I don't even know if I have an opinion. I like Halo's grenades. There you go. Uh, Best grenade ever. Gren the grenades from the Jersey Shore game. Oh, Jesus. I knew that was coming for some reason. Actually, technically, isn't that U Star game? Oh, it has Jersey Shore in it, and I'm pretty sure they talk about grenades in that game. So, it counts. Boom. Here we go. And this is, uh, I don't know, a neat gameplay element. I'm trying to remember, uh, first Gears of War had, like, those, uh, like, deadly raven things that would kill you when you walked outside. Remember there was that level where you had to be careful where you walked or this thing would swarm down from yeah. the sky and kill you? Uh, Brendel says, revive me, daddy. <laughs> Which, I, I just want to, I want to play... There you go. Danger. Oh, my God. Get out of the way. I want to play a random, like, a horde board mode with some random person, play as GD, hope they play as Marcus, and then just say, thanks, daddy. This is really tough. Come on, we're almost there. This thing will kill you almost instantly. No, no, no. Don't let those hit the DeLorean. And now that we're safely inside the barn, <laughs> get it. The gears of war. The robots won. will remember this. That is. That's going to conclude our look at the campaign. Um, but we're going to try and jump into some horde mode. Uh, we're going to make a separate video for that because I don't. I have no idea if it's going to work. Uh, but let us know if you want to play some horde mode at some point. We're thinking about doing that with our patrons, or maybe just I don't know some random Friday. I fucking love horde mode. Um. Let's, let's see this out, I suppose. But yeah, find out more at lasertimepodcast.com. We had a great new show up this week uh, about confusing timelines in games. I thought that was, or in, in, mostly games in this episode, right? Uh, Fast and Furious and Star Trek. Are in but Zelda and, uh, and Metal, Gear. Metal Gear. Yeah, probably mostly and games. And Castlevania. <laughs> oh, well, I, I should play this part. Yes, yeah, sorry. Not closed yet, because this is ridiculous. You could be it's just getable, my um, what, there was a oh krill yeah, but, yeah so the t1000 is after you in the semi truck <laughs> what the hell is that it's called a vulture but your That's way right? out James, of line <laughs> are you singing a terminator 2 song yeah yeah you could be mine i forget what the, oh roses. you could be mine with a bitch stuff oh, yes, and fire. a coating coating comes get Mm. Back. The so way. you can clear the uh, entryways by shooting at them. Not a lot to shoot here. It's a good way to close Man, out the stream, though. Going? Motorcycle ball. level, or as I like to call it, loco cycle There's level. Hey. It's, not what's there. it's a little loco cycle I just missed that game. That game. Locus cycle. I, I keep having to remind myself to unpin it from my... Uh, <laughs> My Wait, Xbox home menu. Actually, you have been. We just always repin it. Oh, man. Yeah. I knew something was going on. It's like how we always make sure that uh, uh, Chili Con Carnage is always out and displayed. Watch it. It's trying to burn us out. Again, I hate to compare this to Uncharted. I just thought Uncharted had the better motorcycle scene this year. Um. Damn it. I can't see shit. <laughs> Night Demon Fire says, Gears of Right to Hell Retribution. Yeah, this motorcycle is really fast, so that plane can James, stay <laughs> what do you think I'm oh. doing? in motion very slow. Oh, it's real heavy. Look out! Didn't have to look out. Shot him. Shot him. Shot him. Oh, they might just oh, ran out. Oh, this isn't good! Oh. Back up, back up. Is that <laughs> 
Frankly, man go. says, good job. Good thing that this random terrain is an imperfectly shaped this road. Yeah. Take another landing like that. Screw the bike. I can't take another landing like that. I'm trying to drive here, McLean. <laughs> Bad idea. Bad, Bad idea. More fireballs. Let me drive. She was asking for more fireballs. <clears throat> You don't even really have to do much. I don't even know if you can ah, fail this level. Look out! Ah, look out. <laughs> Nothing happened. <laughs> yes! Uh, CDG Comedy says Gears has usually been superior in gameplay while Uncharted has a story. Yeah. And it's engines! I, I say that's probably fair, but I just like. I actually like the cutscenes a lot more in uh, Uncharted. And there were just. There were so many, like. Wow moments, uh, crescendo moments in uh, Uncharted. More than I've encountered, and I'm, I think I'm over two thirds done with uh, gears. <clears throat> Mr. Kessler. Oops, forgot my reload there. Hello, hello. Tunnel up ahead. All right, I think we're safe. Sure, we are. Everywhere Marcus Venus goes, he like destroys the entire yeah. world. I gotta leave everything in geological ruin. But I saved the world. Remember that. All right, enough of this. Shit. This is the Fast and the Furious 16, the endless runway. Thing. Take out the <laughs> engines. The fucking scene is so good, though. I do not care about the logistics. Yeah. The ending of this game better be uh, uh, Marcus and his son doing the Fast and Furious uh, 7. Because <laughs> <laughs> we're coming for you, Marcus. Jason Statham. I don't care for your DLC. <laughs> of course, take out the uh, giant orange things. I can't totally. Oh yeah, I can't aim it. My bad. Forgot. So it's, it's this is the difference. I got to steer and uh, aim. Ugh. Yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> I didn't fail it before, but I'm scared now because that's the most red I've ever seen. Hey, we're not gonna last long against this thing. Full Amish asks, how, mu how much money and resources is this woman wasting trying to kill four assholes? So, uh, <laughs> and why is this plane just staying there when it's being shot at with no means of defending itself, but dropping the same payload it's been dropping? We're not it done yet! Shoot the guns! Now shoot we the can guns? shoot. It's an old 1943 approach. Now the guns go out. Oops, missed my reload. Do, 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 do. Okay, I played this bit in Uncharted, just frankly, Come man. On, Dad, bring that vulture down. Does that not sound like Nolan North and anybody else? It's hard as exposed. <laughs> it's plain heart. It's a Gradius boss now. Shoot the core. Dad, I put a giant star above it on your <laughs> eyeballs. Don't shoot the Captain Zord's <laughs> weak point. What if we all just slammed on our brakes and the plane Whoa. flew ahead and had to find us again? And I'll ask the, uh, the obvious question that we're going to get in the stream. Hmm. How would Marcus sound as Adam Sandler? <laughs> hey guys, frag out! Fragging out is fucking hard. Awesome. Revive me! <laughs> get to the fucking engine! <sighs> Uh, that ramp reminds me. Today I rounded right, the corner guys. on my bike. We're going to join some horde mode. Join us there in a second. We'll be live for the Twitch audience, obviously. Um, but geez, we're going to play more horde mode in the next video. Thanks, guys.